Hello everybody, welcome to the sound test room. Today we're going to take a look at Sampletron and the Hammond B3X, both from IK Multimedia and uh, both because they're on sale at the moment throughout November. So IK are holding this uh, Black Friday sale all the way kind of through November. So basically Sampletron is 50% off and so is the B3X. Both are superb instruments. Uh, we're going to go through some of the patches from both of them, have a look around the apps, uh, just so to see if it's something that you may want to get while it's on sale. Uh, Sampletron is on sale at £44.99p, and the Hammond is on sale at £49.99p. So both quite expensive apps uh, at full price, and, and some may say expensive even on the sale. However, however... They are very, very, very good. So without further ado, let's have a look. So we're going to start with Sample Trans Default Patch here. And we shall just make this full screen. And have a shifty. So you get loads of stuff. You get all the Mellotrons. Okay, so if we go into Edit here, and you can tap on any of these as well but if you go into edit you can edit the three layers independently so make you remember back in the day with the mellotrons you could blend between two sounds here right there you go um however with this you can mix all three so at the moment we're selected on solo flute there is nothing in track b so if we tap on the the uh menu we can choose a model of Mellotron, say the classic M400, then we could choose, say, strings for track B. Okay, so then we just double click to load. And now on track B, if we move that down, is our strings. And if we move to track C, we can choose maybe something from a Novatron. Maybe the, let's see, uh, we take out the M400 and choose maybe uh, choir, double click. So we've got the three instruments there, but now we can mix them all together with mix. Let's go on to our Tron again and here we have some controls for the actual sound. But I'm just going to go to... Uh, I'm going to close edit and lower the volume on some of these. So here in the mixer, we can choose between um, the pan... The volume, the fine tune. Uh, transposing. You also have a tone control and a release. And an attack. And then you have this synth section, which uh, has a filter. Full amplitude ADSR here. And then you can link, for the filter and the ADSR, you can have either it just on A, B, C, or you can link them all, which is very nice. One of the nicest things about the Sampletron are the effects. So it has a block of four effects here. Channel strip, tape echo, tape echo, tape echo, multi-modulation and a vintage plate. So you can hear the plate is on. Put the mix up a bit. Modulation for the 
reverb, and then if we switch multi mod on, we have different things here. We've got ensemble, rotary, phaser, chorus, and flanging. And then we have a tape echo. Let's switch that on. And then we have a channel strip, which is already on, and that gives us kind of EQ control, etc. Comp, but again. One of my favorite parts is if we choose, say, maybe a celestial strings and choir patch. You'll see this top section here. Now you'll see the instrument has changed, but let's put mix off. So we're just hearing this violins. Or maybe the modern choir. We switch tape effects on. We can start to well do all sorts of cool stuff to the tape and you can see that you can do it for all three sections independently so we're on b That's nice, gives like a lo-fi kind of distortion. And then just for aesthetics, you can have a look at the tape machine running. Using the modulation wheel on your keyboard, you can add vibrato. I guess that's pre-mapped. Pitch bend up and down. Okay, so after that, you just basically please yourself. You know, you can, there's all sorts of cool stuff you can do. But it's, it sounds lovely. It comes with loads and loads and loads of presets. So that's Sample Tron. Let's have a look at the, I've just got to close this down. Let's have a look at the Hammond. Now, again, this is made in conjunction with Hammond. So you're getting like the genuine, genuine article. <laughs> So with Hammond organs, it will react differently if you if you're play, if you're playing kind of legato or or not taking your fingers completely off the keys, you'll get this effect. The initial one, you will hear the click, and then after that, if I hold this C and just play uh, uh, ne next notes, and then if I play a kind of staccato. Using the mod wheel, we'll switch on your Leslie. Over, you have an effects section. Uh, 
uh, EQ. set this for the upper the lower the pedals etc let's go on to a, let's go on to a different patch and then you have cabs different types of amplifier control this as you wish and then you have your after effects sort of things so you have a limiter uh, eq 81 Very, very, very good quality effects, obviously. Lovely. Let's just take that down a sec. Oh, sorry, guys. Just put a... So let's have a listen to a few of the presets, shall we? I must admit, one of my favourite things to play with is the actual tape effects. Now, just be just make sure that you know which instrument you're on. We're obviously on A, so we want to be putting this on A. I'm just going to run through a few effects from both of them. I'm going to mute the microphone just so I give you an idea of this of the sound. One of the nice things about the orchestra and sounds are the loops. If you go into loops, oh, there's not more for this. Uh, what uh, the octagon? Excuse me. In the octagon uh, engine, take orchestra off. 
click it in. So you can do some mad sampling with this, I tell you. If we just switch mix off here and, and concentrate on C. If any of you are familiar with Ioptagon, <laughs> Very cool. Look, yeah, the orchestra sounds are, are very nice as well. Let's take it off and just go for everything. Mix in. Fantastic. been one of mine look at this just loads <laughs> Like I said, you know, you can explore all this stuff. It's 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 well worth exploring all these sounds and then you know you can mix and match any of them you like, any of the three sounds, infinite really. Uh I wouldn't like to calculate the amount of variation you can get, but you know, it's a bit too huge. <laughs> okay, and a few patches from uh Hammond to finish off, I guess. So, uh, yeah, there you go. Sample Tron and Hammond B3X, both on sale, both by IK Multimedia, uh, during November. So hopefully this gives you an idea of a comparison between the two. Of course, you can... Uh... <laughs> Blend between the two and create even more wild possibilities. Very vintage sounding, both of them, obviously, because they're based and sampled from vintage gear. Um, 
So, you know, if you're into that vibe, uh, I love it, you know, but, uh, you know, some people don't. So they more, want to be stay more modern, uh, which is fine. Anyway, top job, cool beans. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bless you all. Uh, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Please consider becoming a Patreon. Uh, help support what me and Joe do. It'll cost you a dollar a month. Uh, and, you know, it really does help, you know, because, you know, we, we don't have a lot of money. We're completely community-based uh, business. So, you know, without you, we're nothing. Anyway, brilliant. Top job, cool beans. And I will see you guys later. Ta-da.